literally just thought I broke my camera and I was having a meltdown. It wouldn't come back on because I'll fucking slab hands here, all right? Pulled the back bit away. So I feel like I need to see what I'm, like the viewfinder, you know? So the camera, like I'm looking into the camera now, but the viewfinder on the side, like I like to see it. So if I'm like showing you my bread, <laughs> bread, um, oh, fuck off. I just want to know that I've got it in shot, do you know what I mean? I could be like that. And there's my bread. <laughs> you know what I mean? So yeah, it wouldn't come on because I pulled it away. Like, it's already loose. And then to flip it out, I flipped it the wrong way and I literally yanked the screen off the attachments and it made a crunchy noise. Oh, and I was like, I just can't be doing with this. <laughs> Turns out it's not. So yeah, meltdown over. Um, yeah how are you i hope you're all right me and my greasy head are still greasy all right i've not washed it i will <laughs> i need to fucking leave me beer all right i'm on annual leave i have bought a new t-shirt today though but i've left it in the car it's a steve rhodes stephen rhodes and it says sick of your shit and then somebody in bed like in like with a thermometer and then there's like a card that says get well soon I just love it honestly I just love it so yeah yeah a life story I know but anyway I've been to Aldi so I've been meaning to go to Aldi for ages because I keep spending a tenner here at Tesco a tenner there and you know I did nip to Lidl yesterday though met Brenda didn't I I was in my own world in Lidl Steve was like babe babe I was like oh so yeah it's really nice to meet you Brenda if you are watching um, yeah, really nice to meet you. So I just popped in to grab a uh, barbecue pulled pork and brioche buns for the lads tea, some mango, not mango, water. why? It, it doesn't even matter. It doesn't even matter, all right, literally. I'm fucking telling you every single detail of my life. But yeah, it was nice to meet you, Brenda, yesterday. So yeah, you're really lovely. Uh, but yeah, I've been to Aldi because I keep pissing about, you know, dilly dallying here, dilly dallying there. So I went to Aldi and um i love ray's new song ray's new songs on so yeah i went to Aldi, done a massive food shop to last May because like i said i'm on annual leave i just want to crack on with the house you know i've got a lot around the house to do so instead of like pissing about i have got football tonight mason's joining a new football club so it's a little bit of a drive so yeah i'm, I'm doing that tonight tomorrow he's got a rounders club as well after school and i've got to pick him up I don't know what time I've got to pick him up yet. But yeah, I've got a lot around the house to do that I want to do. So, you know, I, I kind of just want to get all the shopping out of the way. I've got loads of cat litter. So I've got these, but I've left loads in the car. So I've picked up quite a few. So... Oh, shit. <laughs> Fucking hell. Do you know, my arms are weak as shit, honestly. My legs, all right. My legs, I can fucking boot into next week but my arms honestly you know honestly they're so weak i did shoulders today in the gym so i went to the gym i keep doing this in the mirror it's still very bingo winger i oh, can shave my pits it's still very bingo winger i got a long way to go <laughs> i've got a long way to go but um yeah put it away girl i did shoulders and it, do you know doing these like oh i don't know if i've injured some of you so you know them ones oh my god the burn absolutely done me but honestly i'm really strong on my legs also as well this t-shirt gets a lot of comments from people when I'm, ugh, if I'm out shopping or in the gym what did someone say in the gym once what's that say what's that say oh dog father oh you like soup dog <laughs> i do do <laughs> snip doggy dog yeah i do and then um i was out shopping and i heard someone behind me go what's that say dog father because <laughs> on the back it says dog father so you know i love snoop dog i want a foo fighters t-shirt i've been listening to the foo fighters yeah i've been absolutely rocking out to the foo fighters also nickelback another fave too bad i love that one nickelback too bad so yeah i want a foo fighters t-shirt though i do so faye's gonna window shop on vinted tonight when everyone's in bed i'm just gonna cozy up 
I've been watching um, Nightmare on Elm Street, the box set. Steve's got the box set. So we started one the other day. When I were a kid, that absolutely fucked me up, honestly. I watched it on my own like a twat. And I was like, yeah, yeah, I'll be fine, you know me. Put it on, scared the life out of me, honestly. And it, it really scared me. So, yeah, to watch it again, it was like, I don't know about this. But, yeah, it, it was all right. I'm going to watch the next one tonight, maybe. I want to get back into The Walking Dead. I still haven't got that. The Fear of the Walking Dead. I still haven't watched it. I got really into it. Do you remember? I just kept fucking going on about it. And now I haven't watched it for ages. I don't even know where I'm at. What happened last? You know, so. Yeah, I need to, I need to get into it. But anyway, my ice lollies are going to melt. I'll get on with it. If you do want to stick around, you know. Um, yeah. Now I've done my food shop. I can just focus. Focus on the house. I'm thinking, what are you thinking about? People are saying I can paint these cupboards. Can I, without it looking like there's paint marks everywhere? Because I know when I paint something, there's just strokes here, strokes there. It's never a clean fucking, you know. So I don't know. But I'm thinking like, white walls, navy cupboards. No, I don't know, I don't know. Anyway, stick around. I'd really appreciate it if you did. I forgot bread. I've got bread rolls. I've got thins, but I forgot bread. How much bread have I got? That's how much bread I've got. Anyway, whatever. Right, I've got some potatoes. I can't, because I don't go Aldi that often, but I, the reason I really wanted to go Aldi is for all this look. So I like a zero sugar pop, I do. And this is like Lil, Tropical Blast, zero sugar. And this one is um, Fanta Lemon, but you know, their version. So, and they're really cheap as well, but I, because I don't go often, I can't remember all the prices. So, uh, you know, I, I'll remember what I can. But potatoes, I think they were like one pound thirty-five, something like that. So, yeah, just some um, white potatoes for ideal for everyday use. So, you know, to just make a few chips here and there, or sometimes if the lads want a few roast potatoes or something. Right, listen, I don't like the. This was one pound twenty-nine. I don't like the taste of the one cow sprays i've not tried this one but um see olive oil see i like i like an egg i don't use oil if i'm frying an egg i don't use any oil so it's not like fried it's just in the pan you know poached egg i'm shit at so yeah i'm really terrible at doing a poached egg even though i like poached egg but i'm terrible so sometimes you know, if I'm doing mushrooms or something, I just need a little, little summit to juice it up a bit, you know, because just, just watching it shrivel, like it ain't, do you know what I mean? Because it ain't like got any moisture in there. So I thought one cow spray and somebody that I follow that, um, you know, does like nutrition and fitness and stuff said, um, like they, they shown, what did she show? Two bur two um, turkey pitters and she said one 600 calories and one was like, 200 calories and the difference was things like she's cooked with one cow spray and like lighter than like mayo that kind of thing so yeah i'm i'm not sure i'm not sure but we'll give it a go so and then my lads go through so much shower gel i got loads of just this one so yeah because i haven't been poundland or in bargains or anywhere for ages so i haven't done any of that so um i just got a load of these are like 35 to 45p I think this one was 45 and this one was 35 so i got quite a few of them because literally you know they they use so much you know they have a shower before school and sometimes especially mason if he's been doing a lot of sport he'll have one before bed you know because mason loves his sport you know so he's always a sweaty mess from playing out with friends like i said he's like doing like sports clubs and stuff like that so i've got some uh, muscle soak um some links as well just why not eh? oh shit i just scraped a bit of fruit down my nail what was that these easy peelers they were 69p i'm just randomly putting stuff anywhere i've only got a few pots in this thing i don't know how much these were but they were 50 percent off and my lads really like them so some corn on the cob these little salads just because i chuck them with whatever so i have got a load of chicken so i literally will just chuck it with some chicken i've got a sous chef because sometimes i like a sous chef you know I, I just do um these are protein crisps just 
got to get it go, you know. Air dried, not fried. So there's some like new bits in here that, like I said, I don't go out a lot, so a lot of it is new. Some of it's just your staples, but you know. And in Tesco, like I've wanted some of these to go with my sourdough and egg. And in Tesco, this is quite expensive, about four quid. This was 190, 199? I have not 149, it was 199. This was it. Might have been 249. Well, anyway, it's cheaper than Tesco, and I really like this on, um... Oh, look, all right, mess. I've been meaning to wash my bloody hair. This is what annual leave does to me. Saying that, I can't even blame annual leave and not doing anything, all right, because I'm a fucking scrub anyway, honestly. <laughs> Got some vinegar, because I've never had vinegar, and I always use pickle juice, which I really like. That was only 35p. Some chipotle sauce. I love a bit of this stuff. That was 149 so yeah, that's that's a new one from um, Aldi that I've not seen. I've got some pomegranate seeds for my oats in the morning and some cherries. They were 79p, these were 99p. So, Dingo, aka Crash, really likes these. So Crash has sardines with his biscuits in the morning. He's also raw fed as well, Crash is. So he has, um, we have like, it's packs of raw and he has one or two in the evening depends really you know if he's had treats and that kind of thing but um they're 52p they were but he loves the fish he loves it so obviously you can't have it too much but he, he does love it mixed in with his biscuits got some blueberries they were 79p my bits here so some crisps my lads don't really like aldi crisp i don't know why but i've still got loads from last time i went out there in my cupboard they just didn't eat it but you can't go wrong with cheese and onion you know and i got these as well because these are 73 calories a bag oh i've got two of these oh get oh, that's a workout and obviously i don't know if i've injured this arm you know this shoulder my right one because oh, i did back day the other day <laughs> which uh, when i hear myself saying it i'm hard fuck off but yeah i did back day the other day and i can really feel it do you know if i'm like doing the like the pulley out thing and the lateral pull down so honestly i know i know got some beans uh, a couple of sauce oh, fuck off a couple of sauces so a, a mild chili con carne and a bolognese and a korma i did get a korma as well because i've got a lot of chicken and meat and stuff i'm gonna cereal i got these i did get some of the crave as well but my lads like these as well they were like 79p um yeah these bread rolls 49p um these are nice so they're french inspired lentils they're really nice pour it on a jacket potato with some like cheese you know quite nice basmati rice um joe said in the comments to get a rice cooker now I don't really like rice that much. This is for the lads. I had some recently and it was okay, but I'm not really a rice pasta fan, that kind of thing. You know, I just say it's not really my bag. Um, I'm like chips. You know, if I have a curry, I want a portion of chips. Do you know what I mean? Like, I don't really, yeah, I don't really like rice or pasta, but it's not, I don't hate it. I just, I don't know. I don't like it, but I might... I mean, these do for now, just in the microwave, bish, bash, bosh. But, you know, it was recommended to get a rice cooker because I do fuck it up in the pan. I do. They were about 49p each. Honestly, I'm, I really fuck it up. These, just because I'm a bit lazy. So I've just got two of them. I have got a pack of eggs as well. But just for pure ease, if I'm on the go, a little bit of liquid in there is making me feel a little bit funker. I got um, another one of them. Like I said, lads go for it. Uh, beans, strawberries, bananas, and some carrot battens. So I got these just so I can I can just gnaw on one every so often. Do you know what I mean? Just, you know, have a nibble here and there. I got this. You don't want to know what? No, I'm joking. <laughs> joking, all right. Some mixed peppers. Um, <laughs> got some korma. Korma sauce, uh, wonky apples, these are like 79p, 
all the 85 piss what I mean. I need if I if I went Audi all the time I'd be able to reel it off. I can reel it off for Tesco. Even Lidl. You know, Lidl I can give it a good <laughs> can I can't even say it. Lidl I can give it a good go. Yeah, um basically mini cheddars. Um couple of protein mousses. I love the mousse. So these are £1.29 each, got 20 grams of protein and you know green all down the side it's not bad it's not bad you know i've still got my grenade bars on my little air fryer i love them it's, i look forward to my grenade bar 1.2 grams of sugar i actually had a look how much sugar was in a snickers 30 grams of sugar because i thought surely you could just have a snickers you know i know you're doing the grenade for the protein and you know it's a nice nice little bit of you know something i fucking love grenade bars all right but I just thought, yeah, surely you can have a Snickers. Well, worked it out. Yeah, 30 grams. No, was that a Mars? It was Mars or Snickers. Had 30.6 grams of sugar in. 30.6 grams of sugar in. That's a lot for one chocolate bar. Now, sometimes, sometimes I could easily have two or three. Not a problem. I also looked at the Belgian finest um, cookies because I know I go on about them a lot, but they, they have a place in my heart, they do. All right, the Tesco finest deluxe fucking cookies 303 calories per cooker i was smashing the bag honestly and the sugar 20 grams per cooker you know what i mean split parts they were 250 uh, i've got some cheese spread a few packs of ibuprofen i need some supplements actually i've ran out of um optibac which is my probiotic it's a mingy probiotic, not for your stomach. I don't know if it works, all of it though. I don't know. COQ10. I've only got a few of them left and all. So, yeah. These are 149 for the lads. Um, they're hot puddings. Hot milk chocolate sticky puddings. A block of butter, because I had the other spread in. This was two quid. No, it was 150. This was 150 for salted butter. Um, ketchup. Oh no, barbecue and ketchup. I got four jacket potatoes, so there's four in there. Some spaghetti. And these, which were 250, Chinese style hot dogs. I think the boys are gonna really like these. So just to switch it up, you know. They're quite big and all, you know. So I grab them. Oh, I got a few of these. Protein um like shake type things. So Yeah, it's my potatoes. Everything's in my sink now. I've only got a few pots in there. Yeah, now. Now I'm in the gym, but... Right, I need to get these in my freezer, actually. So, twisters, but they're called whirls. So, I do love a twister or a whirl. I do. And, um, yeah, just... They're just nice, you know? Right, I got a load of these steaks. So... Steve's got a sirloin. I don't like sirloin steak. I like the cheap steak. Yeah, I like the cheapest one. Just whatever's lurking about. I don't, I had a sir, what did I have recently? Like I do like it, but I prefer the cheaper one. So this, I think it is sirloin I don't like. I can't remember. Well, anyway, Steve got that. The boys have got these steaks. They look nice. And then I've just got the, this was the cheapest, 2 99 I got that one. I prefer that one. I feel like the, I had one of the sirloin ones before and it was just very like fat air. Like it had a lot of, do you know what I mean? Couldn't be arsed with it. Some chicken bakes, £1.19, what a bargain. Breakfast pork patties. These have got 96% pork. I'm gonna make, where are they? These lot, I'm gonna make the lads. Look, these are hash browns to go. Look at them, they're all 99 and I think they were, about one night as well actually but i'm gonna make a little um, breakfast to go for the lads i am um, i got some prawns they were 250 these are tomato and basil prawns this is what the lads are gonna have tonight if they want it i mean see what they want but i was thinking like tonight to do it so thigh fillet burgers so with corn on the cob I've got some grapes i've not used um swigging my drink i've not used their shampoo and conditioner this is the liqueura oil complex one i have got the other one somewhere uh some of them 
some of that beef slices. I got some three percent fat mints. Three percent fat. Mince. So ninety nine p. That's the cheapest I've seen. Free range eggs. Ninety nine p for a pack of six. I haven't seen it that cheap anywhere else. Got loads of wipes. Two. Well, I got four. Two up, two down. Um, high protein bars. And um, these have only got one point nine grams of sugar in per bar. Love a bit of peanut butter, you know. I do. Right, here's my meat look and some toothpaste. So I got all them. These were well cheap, you know. These were about three quid, about two ninety nine. And then I got a massive tray of chicken breast as well. That was nine ninety nine. So yeah, I've got some chicken breast. I got um, tur lean turkey mince because I'm going to make some turkey burgers. Just season it with whatever I've got going on. And um, yeah, just you know. Cappuccinos, light baby bells, Kit Kats, um, those, pizzas. Right, listen, Pop Tarts are quite expensive. These are £1.69. That's the cheapest I've seen, so I thought I would um, grab them. Got some cheese and some cheese strings. Here are look, these were 4 99 for Chinese pork loin steaks for a massive pack. So this is what I mean, I just wanted to get everything out of the way and then I can just focus on my kitchen, you know, and get the house. I've got quite a bit of um, housework I want to do, you know. I want to, like, I might even paint the lad's bedroom, do you know what I mean? I'm, I just want to, I've got my appointment tomorrow. I don't know when you'll see this video, so it's the 20th anyway, or... Um, appointment I can't remember I don't know it is my phone what do you call it it is appointments uh, so pre-op prep will include a medical history and discussion regarding the schedule of your treatment and medications and Q&A's that's tomorrow that is tomorrow Got some more baby wipes, like I said, two up, two down. Some of that cereal, a few of these. Um, some rad, no, blueberries, these are frozen. I want a blender, I'm sure I've got one. That's why I've not got one yet, because I think, well, I'll check at home. And then um, this blood orange cider, which sounds quite nice as well, woo. So, yeah, that is everything from the shop. Like I said, I've got quite a few cat litters. There's a few in the car, so. Um, yeah, just the big shop, get it out of the way, job done, can just crack on with what I need to do, you know. So, yeah, it's nice having a few days off work. I mean, I've still got quite a bit off work, but it's nice, you know, just having that little bit of time off. So, yeah, I've been very lazy and <laughs> I'm just, I'm, yeah, I've done a, a bit of fuck all, really. But anyway, I'm going to go. I hope you um, have a nice evening, whatever you're up to. Don't let any of the kids get you down. You're absolutely amazing. I love you. I'll see you in tomorrow's video.